All right, welcome back to Dust and Elysian Tale. Let us continue on. Hmm. <laughs> Boom. I'll go the other way. <laughs> Show us more ground. Flipping. Get the feeling I got to knew it. It's gonna have to bring one of those bomb things down here. I'm glad that doesn't hurt. <laughs> I'd be blowing myself up all the time. Okay, I don't have to be right on it. If this takes too long, I'll just blow it up on my own time. And I got wall chicken. <laughs> That's why it gave me so many keys. Oh! Super Meat Boy. My friend. Nice! Super Meat Boy. Yeah, I gotta crawl. But Super Meat Boy! I ought to put that on my uh, on my wish list. That way, it goes on sale. I can buy it. Heard a lot of good things about it. Looked like a hell of a lot of fun too. <laughs> but let us move on. We now have a city or village to go towards. 
Super Meat Boy. Hmm. Not a problem at all. Stand back. All right, I've got it. Wait, no. Oh. Having some trouble there? Yeah, I don't know. I just can't get a good enough grip. Hmm. Aw, you're just trying to show off. That's sweet. <laughs> don't worry about it. I'm sure there's a way to get up there. We'll just come back later. Probably need a knife. Whoa. Oh. Let us move on. Uh, I had the feeling when I walk in here they're gonna be like ah looks like we're heading in the right direction be on your guard dust I sense a powerful foe ahead of you don't worry dust I'll be behind you every step of the way way behind I knew it <laughs> <laughs> it's another one of those spiky slime things their persistence I'll give them that much as I pity this corrupted beast, now might be a good time to demonstrate the parry technique. Parry? Allow it to strike. Ah, uh, okay. Hey, you dazed it! Attack and hold the button at the moment of the enemy strike, and you will parry their attack, opening them up for a counterattack. Okay. Timing is crucial, and you must be facing your opponent. And as you can see, a successful parry may also daze your opponent temporarily. Now, put this beast out of its misery. Okay. I'm God, parry. Hmm. Village. I see somebody over there. Ask them if they've got anything to eat. We're in a bit of a hurry, fidgets. Don't worry, I'll feed you later. Hey, I'm not a pet. But, uh, I would appreciate that. Thanks. <laughs> oh. oh, hello. You surprised me there. Don't get many travelers this far out of town. Sorry about that. It's nice to finally meet a friendly face. So we're getting closer to the village then? Maybe. You mean Aurora Village? Yes. It's just beyond those fields to the east. And I think you might be just in time. Or? What do you mean? The My monster dad. attacks down there have been getting worse. Right before you showed up, I swear I heard somebody shouting. Uh. She's right, Dust. I can hear somebody calling for help further down the path. Time to be a hero. Yes. Please hurry. Be careful. Cora. Please. Oh, next turn. <laughs> okay. Good to know. Aha. He bunnies. Oh! Look at the size of that thing! Don't worry, I think I can handle it. I think I can. I think I can. Learn dust. Send these foul creatures from this existence.
Ooh. No, wait! That's not all of them! Uh, here comes some more! Oh! Oh! Oh my! Hmm. Is that it? Did we get all of them? <sighs> yeah, I think that's it. Well done, Dust. You have proven yourself a worthy swords master, and none too soon. I also pay attention to my health. Uh, they weren't so tough. I could probably take on another four or five of them. You know, if I had to. And Dust was there. Oh, thank you <laughs> so much. What happened here? Ah, fidget. <laughs> I don't know. We were out here checking the fields when those giants attacked. We've been having a lot of problems with smaller beasts, but this is the first time a giant has ever come this close to the village. They're not rock the solid. The first step of your journey is near its end dust. The village lies just ahead. Yes, we arrived. Mm. That's great. But what now? That has not yet been revealed to me. Mm. These people are safe, and that is what is important. Let us continue onward. All right. Will you two be all right? <laughs> yes. I just need a moment to rest. I'm not sure how you did it, but you took down three giants single-handedly. Not a problem. That's what we do. Bringing justice to the weak and defenseless. Hey! Who are you calling weak? Hmm. Oh, skill jump. We're still a little shook up, but I think we'll be fine. Uh -huh. I just need to sit here for a while. <laughs> My leg still hurts. You should get to safety when you can. I cleared out quite a few monsters on the way in, but you never know when they'll be back. Did one of those monsters hurt you? Well, I mean, not exactly. <laughs> this old lug twisted his ankle running away from those monsters. Nice of you to stick around to protect your poor old wife. I was running to get help. Yeah, lots of help in the tool shed, I'm sure. <laughs> what, you got a little army hiding in there? <laughs> Maybe I should go. Oh, no, please don't get the wrong idea. I still love my husband, even if he is a coward. Bah. Oh, by yourself. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my. Um, go with health on this one. <laughs> oh my. And now into the village. Chapter 1. It is your destiny. Or these are tiny. He's tiny. Aurora Village. Where if I go back? Oh. I was just wondering if there's a world map or anything. Hi! Hold it right there. Are they gone? I don't hear anything. If you're referring to the giants, I took care of them. They're dead? Yep. Thoroughly expired. They were no match for us. There's an older couple back there that could use some help, though. Well, that must have been Oneida and her husband, Gian. Oh, Nida. Thank you. Uh, we'll send help right away. So you're saying you just happened to show up at the right time, huh? I suppose. Interesting coincidence. If you're suggesting I had something to do with this attack... Whoa, whoa, take it easy. I, I have to apologize for my big friend Caleb here. Mm. We're just a little overwhelmed is all. What's been happening here? I guess you missed the endless hordes of bloodthirsty monsters on your way in. They used to stay in the mountains, away from the village. Now, they're attacking us on a daily basis. No one's been hurt yet. At least not until today. Hmm. If the giants are showing up near Oneida's farm, things are far worse than we thought. Speaking of which, where exactly do you come from? 
There's nothing west of here except crazy old Cora. We're, uh... Prospectors! We are prospectors! <laughs> and we're out on an excavation to find, uh, ore deposits in the mountains! You know, gold, silver, um, manganite? Manganite. Prospectors, eh? You're certainly well armed for the job. Like you said, there are a lot of monsters out there. Well, we're indebted to you either way, so go on through. But I'm watching the two of you. Alrighty. Please, make yourselves at home. Bean! Uh, my name is Bean. There's not much here, but we do have a merchant if you need supplies. Alrighty. Thank you. We'll be on our way then. Bean? Thanks so much for your help. Please, make yourselves at home. How are you two holding up? Don't worry about us. I'm in no rush to take on a giant, but I think we're in the clear. Hmm. Fidget. <laughs> I like you a lot. That's an interesting outfit you're wearing. Oh, you're one to talk. Can your friend even see from under that hat? He can see everything. It's spooky, really. <laughs> no reason to get defensive. Just trying to help. <laughs> oh. Prospectors, fidgets. That was the best thing you could come up with. <laughs> it was the first thing that popped into my head. It's not like you had anything better. Come on, let's get away from the <laughs> All right, Zara. Where to now? You're right where you need to be. The answers to your identity lie somewhere in this village. I know this place, and that's for certain. I'm sure I've been here before, but nobody seems to recognize me. You also wear a giant to umbrella hat. Recognize them. Yet I feel there is something here that may yet trigger your memory's return. Maybe we should look around for a bit, then? If you really have been here before, maybe somebody will recognize you. That is a good idea, Fidget. Let us meet with the townspeople. I am certain that the next step of your journey will reveal itself in time. Very well, but something, something here is making me uneasy, like the calm before a storm. Hmm, foreshadowing. So most likely, since I'm amnesiac and old school RPG element stuff, either I'm someone's son who ran away to join the military, or I'm part of a military organization of bad guys, but I don't remember. Let's find out. <laughs> uh, quest oh, quest givers. Okay, what do you got of Augustine? Why, hello there. I'm always thrilled to see a new face, even when it's all covered up like yours. Indeed. Well, my name is Dust, and this is Fidget. Hiya! Don't mind Mr. Grumpy. He's not big on the whole eye contact day. <laughs> Fidget and Dust, eh? Not from around here, are you? Well, neither was I originally. But this is a nice little place, if you're not in a hurry. Oh, where are my manners? I'm Augustine, local strongman. Say, you want to arm wrestle? Uh, some other time, perhaps. We're just passing through. Ah, oh, that's a shame. Thought you looked like the arm wrestling type. You know, I heard what you did back there for a nighter. Great stuff. Maybe we can help each other out? What do you got? Maybe. Two belts? What did you have in mind? I have an old friend. A blacksmith. Lives way up at the top of Archer's Pass. I promised I'd deliver some materials to him way back when, but haven't been up that way in ages. The area's pretty dangerous these days, if you ask me. Maybe you could deliver them for me? Tell you what, if you help me out, I'll give you this blueprint. If you give it to him along with these spare materials, he'll set you on your way right quick. A blacksmith that can craft items from blueprints? I think I'll take you up on that, Augustine. Wow, that's <laughs> great! I knew I could count on you! When you see him, just tell him that old Augustine says hello. Then you explode and light in front of me! I'll be honest, there ain't a whole lot here, but you find a shop near the east entrance. Thanks, Augustine. Maybe we'll drop by. Uh, quest blacksmith. Archer's past. 
Um, uh, yeah, the fence. Map, okay. Now, uh, which way is it? I don't quite remember. Yes? Uh, good morning? Hmm. Is it though? I... well, I guess? He gets. It's wonderful. Well, perhaps you can guess that I really don't want to talk such drivel right now. Go, scurry up and leave me be. Hmm. Um, yeah, this is a good place to stop. We're going over 20 minutes. So yeah, we'll uh, stop here. Then the next episode, we'll come back and t finish talking to Mosca and visit the other set and then see how I get to Archer's Pass. So thank you for joining me today. Y'all have a nice day.